One of the most iconic Christmas sneakers of all time is back, but this time it's been reversed. So let's talk about it. I'm my ball in Philly like I'm Kobe. Give me head and that like she don't know me. Been a one on floor, Juan Kenobi. What's good, everybody? It's your boy Marcus Go Hard back at it again with another sneak review. And today, man, you guys, this is a special video. This is my first review of a non Air Jordan. And today, man, y'all already know what we're talking about, man. The reverse Grinch. So let's get into it. All right, you guys, first and foremost, man, if you're seeing this video, please leave a like, drop a comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. It'll really help your boy out, man, as I continue growing this thing. Also, if you want to see some fire pictures of all of my sneakers, as well as fit checks and even more sneaker content, make sure you follow me on Instagram at 89stilo. And I appreciate everybody, man, that's been tuning into the video so far. Thank y'all so much for the support, man. It truly means the world to me. All right, you guys, this sneaker officially released on December 15th for a retail price of $190. And man, your boy was able to actually hit these for retail on the sneakers app. Now there was a shop drop. I missed on those, man, but I hit these on the release date, which is absolutely crazy. Now, resale prices for a size 10 and a half in this sneaker right now are going for around $450. I do believe that's going to go up. I mean, if you look at the OG Grinches from 2020, man, those prices, they usually fluctuate a little bit. But I mean, right now they're looking like, you know, they're staying around that $1,000 mark, man. So I do believe these are going to go up. But resale prices... Not really what I talk about on this channel, man. So let's get into some of the details of the Kobe 6 Reverse Grinch. All right, you guys, we will start things off with the box here. As you can see here, we do have a black on black box. We have that Kobe symbol there on top with Kobe Bryant's signature. And the official colorway is going to be bright crimson and black. Man, I don't know where Nike gets these names, but let's go ahead and take a look at the Kobe 6 Reverse Grinches. All right, you guys, here it is, man. The Kobe 6 Reverse Grinch. Let's start at the bottom and work our way up to the top. So as you can see here, uh, toward the front of the outsole here, man, we have kind of a semi-translucent, uh, very bright red rubber. Uh, we bring it to the center here. We have that nice carbon fiber um, on the back here right here man we have more of a kind of uh just more complete kind of i guess you say kind of dull uh rubber but we got those black specks i really like the black specks man uh and then we got that bright green kobe logo but as you can see there it is in 3d i like that a lot we bring it on up to the midsole um so the midsole man same thing as, I mean, y'all already know, man, it's going to be an all-over red sneaker. But uh, we got that nice, bright red midsole. We got the zoom unit right there in the heel. Do a little 360 for you guys, man. You see that carbon fiber coming up there, too, on the side. Nice little 360. Um, now, here on the heel, you guys, we do have uh, some red patent leather on the back of the sneaker and then over top of that man we have this really nice really honestly looks like candy paint red overlay uh and then on the heel there man we do have kobe's signature in a bright green now one thing i will say that i really do like about the upper you guys is that snake skin texture that covers pretty much the entire upper of the sneaker. Um, one thing that I will say you cannot tell from seeing online, man, is, man, the way that it reflects when the light hits it. I know you guys see that, man. You can't really tell in pictures, but it is really cool. Um, and I also like how they kept that snakeskin texture on the swoosh as well. Uh, the swoosh ba basically looks like they just painted over the texture, um, which makes sense. I mean, it's not like... You know, you could just embroider something on there. I mean, I guess you could, but I do like how they did that detail as well. Um, 
And then, like I said, man, that snakeskin texture literally covers the entire upper of the sneaker. Here in the toe, uh, something that you probably can't see. Come on. Here in the toe, man, something that you probably can't tell from pictures online. Um, right there in the toe, it's going to be darker. Right there in the center of the toe, uh, it's going to be a darker red. It almost looks like it has something black under there. And then the rest of the red is going to be really bright. Now, we do got these really bright green laces that pop. These pop a lot on this sneaker, you guys. Then under the laces, we got a mesh tongue. And then here on the upper part of the tongue, man, I absolutely love this detail. As you can see there, a nice 3D Kobe logo in that bright green. Really pops, man. I like that detail a lot on the sneaker. Uh, what do you guys think about this, man? All right, guys, another detail I wanted to go over really quick is the insoles. All right, so as you can see here, the insoles say, I want a shoe that molds to my foot. Now, on the left shoe, it has the KB, and then on the right shoe, it has the 24. Really like that detail, man. I just think it's something that's cool. It makes the sneaker unique. All right, as you can see, you guys, a really nice pair with super clean details. Now, I got a couple questions for you guys, man. First off, do you think the reverse Grinch is an instant classic? In my opinion, it is. Another question I have for y'all, man, which do you think is better? The OG Grinch or the reverse Grinch? Let me know in the comments. My last question for you guys, man, is this one of the top Christmas themed sneakers of all time? I wanna know what you guys think, man. Sound off in the comments. Me personally, I mean, my number one is gonna be the ugly Christmas sweater dunks, the blue version. Uh, man, that to me, that's just the best Christmas sneaker of all time, man. But let me know what y'all think, man. Where do you rank these out of all of the Christmas themed sneakers? All right, next up, you guys, man, I'm gonna do some on foot looks. I'm gonna throw these on with jeans and I'm also gonna throw them on with shorts just so I can give you guys both looks, man. But before I do that, I just wanted to say thank you so much to everybody that's been tuning into the video so far, man. If you're seeing this one, please leave a like, drop a comment down below, and subscribe to the channel, man. It'll really help your boy out. And until next time, peace. Brand new sneakers, check my footwork. OG bread ones with the red Chicago bull shirt. Don't step on my sneaker, disrespect gon' make me set it off. Swear I'm ass catching with the J's, I gotta catch them all. We ball. Yeah, you know markets go hard, 11's clean so the white look like they can shine in the dark Just no one rocking that heat if I'm at the mall or the park They try to come ride the wave, hope they can swim with the sharks Hey, yeah, yeah, you know markets go, well, hey, yeah, you know markets go hard, hey, yeah, yeah, you know markets go hard They try to come ride the wave, hope they can swim with the sharks, hey, yeah, you know markets go, well, hey and you know markets go hard